New York City. Megan Olivi here. Now this is the latest stop on the UFC Aldo versus McGregor World Tour. Not only are we joined by Dana White, Jose Aldo, and Conor McGregor, but we will also be joined by the co-main event of UFC 189, Robbie Lawler and Rory McDonald, as well as the very passionate New York City MMA fans. <laughs> Alexa, Alexa, why'd you come out today? Because I love UFC. I'm um, more of a Conda fan, but I don't think Conda's gonna take it. I feel like it's the John Jones effect where there's hype behind the fighter, but they won't beat the champion. The way I see it, the past couple of days I've been seeing Aldo getting really irritated with Conor. Conor's just getting in his head, and I I've never seen Josie Aldo this upset about something. And the way I see it now, it's like Conor's in his head already, and I hope it goes down really well in July. Right, I'm concentrating on what I do, getting, getting to work, pushing my body every day, get my mind strong and just I'm gonna go in there and show who I am this time I'm, I'm focused 100% hungrier than ever and uh, you know I'm going for the kill even top 15 featherweights are headlining cards now it's the McGregor division make no mistake about it if I leave if I leave and go to the lightweight division the featherweights go back to the prelims it's that simple you know I'm thankful for all the experience I've had in MMA, the ups and the downs, and uh, you know, I, I, it's all of it's a blessing, and I'm happy to be here. I honestly see it as a separate discipline. There's boxing, there's wrestling, there's jujitsu, but there's also media obligations. That is a separate discipline, and fighters can be broke under that spotlight. It can drain them, and they lose the fight before it even begins. So it is something that I have learned to fall in love with. Not any particular part of it, just in general I have learned to accept it and I have learned to become comfortable. That is what I am about, I become comfortable in the uncomfortable. Então, já tá, é muito tempo eu já tô com esse cinturão. Então, já tô acostumado com tudo. Hoje em dia, graças a Deus, a experiência tá no meu lado. Então, não só ele, mas outros virão também falar, fazer a mesma coisa. Mas todos vão cair como sempre caíram. It's like in the jungle. One king gets old. He starts getting sloppy, he starts stagnating. Then a young gorilla comes up and kills him and takes everything he owns. That is what is happening here. No, for me, I don't take it to this side. What I take is the fight. I'm going to get there, do my work, which is to win. And I'm going to win another one. Jose already f***ed out that opportunity. He had an opportunity to go up and fight Perez and make it a super fight, and he f***ed out. Me, I'd go straight into that division. I'm a laid-back guy, but it's nice to have Connor and Aldo carrying the show and uh, putting on a show for all these fans. But come July 11th, I'm putting on a show. I will enter the contest formless and fearless, and I will put him away. I won't take a back step. I will break him down, rip him limb from limb, and end his career. I'll fight first. I'll fight in the back. I'll fight in the alley. I don't care. I'm not here. For, to be the main event or this or that, I'm here to put on a show and beat people up, and that's what I concentrate on. You know, wherever the fight goes, you know, I feel confident. Again, I, I, I take a very similar approach to Robbie. I, uh, I focus on myself and not my opponents, and you know, I prepare myself for war. Foi isso que eu sempre falei. Enquanto eu tava lutando já, já era campeão. Ele estava assistindo meus vídeos, estava aprendendo comigo. The stance and the range make it very, very difficult. He must close distance to land it, otherwise it will be foot to knee. If it is foot to knee, the foot explodes. I have won contest this way before. He must make his way inside into the pocket, but I have grenades in my pocket. So, é, então, exatamente. É, não vejo nada demais. É, mas uma coisa foi boa. Essa luta promoveu bastante. Então isso faz bem para a categoria também. Mas eu não vejo nada. E como eu te falei, vou continuar sendo campeão. Knowing you can get all these fans out here, what does that mean to you? Knowing, okay, I've, we've got support and people care about this card. You know, I, it doesn't surprise me. Um, you know, UFC fans are always pretty passionate and they always show it in big numbers. New York, you have been absolutely incredible. This world tour has been amazing so far and we are not done yet. We're taking our bags, getting on a shuttle and heading to Toronto, Canada. Toronto, we'll see you tomorrow. And don't forget tomorrow, UFC 189 tickets go on sale. Keep checking UFC.com for everything you need to know.